The Dried Up Fountain by Robert Lighton. Read for LibriVox.org by Ginger Cucolo. Outside the village, by the public road, I know a dried up fountain, overgrown with herbs, the haunt of legendary toad and grass by nature sown. I know not where its trickling life was stilled, no living ears its babbling tongue has caught, but often, as I pass, I see it filled and running o'er with thought. I see it as it was in days of old, the blue-eyed maiden stopping o'er its brim, and smoothing in its glass her locks of gold, lest she should meet with him. She knows that he is near, yet I can see her sweet confusion when she hears him come. No tryst had they, though every evening he carries her pictures home. The ancient beggar limps along the road at thirsty noon, and rests him by its brink. The dusty peddler lays aside his load, and pauses there to drink. And there the village children come to play, when busy parents work in shop and field. The swallows, too, find there the loamy clay, when neath the eaves they build. When cows at eve come crooning home, the boy leaves them to drink, while his mechanic skill within the brook sets up, with inward joy, his tiny water-mill and when the night is hushed in summer sleep and rest has come to laborer and team i hear the runnel through the long grass creep as twere a whispering dream alas tis all a dream lover and lass children and wanderers are in their graves and where the mountain flowed a greener grass its in memoriam waves end of poem this recording is in the public domain.